Messiah, please stop kicking the wall. Who are you? Not much room in the barracks, but there's nowhere I'd rather be. Find day, Sarah. There's Jevon's office. Wait while I explain our initiative. I don't know how they do it where you're from, guardswoman, but I decide the patrols, not you and your whims. You may have been put up for lieutenant in your first year, but I'll have no show-offs in my command. Have I made myself clear? Report to your post before I have you and your Ferelden accomplice jailed. A lot of yelling for doing him a favor. We killed a band of highwaymen. What does it matter whose patrol it was? It's not the first time he's made me wonder like this. Something is very wrong. So let's find out whose toes you actually stepped on. Then we should check the duty roster and see who was supposed to take that route. What have I stepped in this time? Threaten my friends. Not letting that one go, Captain. Hope the day is treating you well, Sarah. Aveline! I owe you for clearing that ambush the other night. Saved me a mess of trouble. Brennan, that route was yours? It was. Single patrol. I'd have been dead for sure. So there was nothing unusual about it at all? It had been clear for weeks. It didn't get unusual until after we heard about you and Aveline. The captain reassigned me after he heard what you did, and I passed the satchel to Donick for his patrol tonight. The satchel? Pay and order assignments. Captain has us run deliveries to the outposts during light duty. It's usually just an updated copy of the roster. The satchel for that night was heavy, though. Anyway, thanks again, Aveline. You're a good one. So the satchel gets heavy the same day we discover an ambush? A messy way to pass information. And Brennan already sent it along. Another guard is walking into the same trap. I can't let that happen. Brennan said Donick. A good man. Donick, Donick. I've got his route. A night walk in Lowtown. Let's go make sure his quiet patrol stays that way. How much longer do I have to wait? I don't make my guards fight gangs in dark corners, but if you'd like to help...
We can't waste. Free drinks for the guards. But accept, and you wake up in the alley. So, here's the thing. We need to find a way into the deep roads. Bartrand can lead us to the right place once we're down there, but we need a good entrance. I've fought Darkspawn, but I've never been to the Deep Roads. Fortunately, I've received some new information. There's a Grey Warden in the city. If anyone knows how to get down there, it'll be him. We don't want trouble with the Grey Wardens, do we? Uh, let's look at our options first. I'd rather not fight a Warden unless we have to. Supposedly, this Grey Warden came in with some other Ferelden refugees not long ago. A Lowtown woman named Lorene has been helping the Ferelden's. We talk to her. Maybe we learn where he is. I'll keep after my contacts, see if I can drum up any other work. Think about it. Why would it start in Ferelden? A dirty backwater full of dogs and the occasional sheep. This one? Less than two years, don't you see? It never happened. It was all a thrilled glory. Being a guardsman seems like a better life than being a soldier. Oh? My brother was a soldier. Always coin and getting rid of idiots. Especially thugs who target the streets just because it's dark. Hard to believe they left me nothing. My children have been in servitude, servitude for a year. They should be nobility. If wishes were poppy, we'd all be dreaming. Why was nothing set aside for us, Uncle? Your mother was supposed to marry the Comte de Lancey, and instead she ran off with some Ferelden apostate. You don't get to stay the favorite when you do that. Where is Father's will? If I could just see for myself. It's not here, all right? It was red. It went in the vault. No one needed to look at it again. Please, Uncle. We have a right to see it for ourselves. Maybe so. But you won't be seeing the bloody thing. It's still locked up on the estate, and that's long out of my hands. You didn't take your parents' will. It was old news. You think I've been sitting here for 25 years waiting for Leandra to slink back? Who bought the estate, Gavin? Perhaps I could speak to them. Was it the Reinhardts? No one you know. Get used to Lowtown, sister. That's where we're going to stay. So, I hate thinking badly of family. But... Did Uncle Gamlin seem a little slippery when he talked about Grandfather's will? If he, say, invested money that was meant to be Mother's, do you think he would tell us? I want what's ours. Good. I'm glad we agree. Gamlin told me he gave the estate as payment to some slaver who beat him at dice. Apparently... Our ancestral home is now a base for slavers from all over Thedas. How could Gamlin let that happen? I think there's a reason Mother didn't talk about him much. Seriously, though, those scum have no right to our family's things. We should break in there. Get the will for Mother. 
I already talked to both of them about this. Gamlin said they guard the front entrance well. But Mother gave me her old key. She said it should unlock the cellar. Apparently the sewers run right beneath the house. I think this is the same cheese that was here a year ago. The streets aren't safe at night. We should do something about that. <laughs> 